Hello once again. Just to illustrate the point, the electronics of it and the electrical wiring, this is, um, I guess, an overview of the internal of any automotive. Doesn't matter make or model, but always obviously there's always sensor. There's all as you can see, <clears throat> shock absorbers, struts as we call them, uh, air springs. There's obviously like you see over here, sensors for the height and everything. All this wiring, you see the harness goes from the front all the way to the back. So it could go under the seats, over the seats, it could go all over. That's a big job. So if you haven't opened anywhere, it is not easy to try to find it. It goes to the fuel pump, goes all over. Remember, sensors, ignition coil, all these things are inputs to the computer. So let's say over here in this one, this example over here, obviously just an example, uh, suspension control module for suspension for, for air springs over here. Uh, it's, so it's amazing. And over here, you see the internals of it. Like you see over here, you see more. These are the springs again. This is the power steering actually over here. You have rack and pinion if it's front wheel. But what is this is showing you is it's just an amazing amount of control control modules actuators um uh, sensors computer modules and this is what goes on from front to back everything is sensed the air fuel the height of the uh, of the of the uh the tires that's why you have tire pressure uh, tire monitoring pressure system when you have a flat what happens to the height it goes down doesn't it when it gets when it gets flat detects it and it gives you the message about low uh, tire pressure, right? So everything has a sensor here. It's, um, it, it, it's overwhelming sometimes. But anyway, this is what the computer needs. So we're going to go into it a little more. There's better diagrams than this. But just to show you an overview of how co complex these vehicles are getting nowadays, modern with electronics and computers, the modules are just increasing and increasing. And now we have the, the serial data maybe one megabit per second and all that the speed is trying to get faster and faster of the data of of, of modules speaking to other modules because more accessories are in demand the more speed of data has to be uh, flowing and one time I'm, i think also they're going to go to actually um a uh, uh, fiber optic wire instead of this regular harness wire. Why? What's quicker than light? Light is quicker than anything, right? So we're going to have fiber optic going all over the place. So just to give you an idea, but an overall view, I mean, this is just a diagram. I mean, to see it is just overwhelming sometimes. How many, how many oxygen sensors, how many mass airflow sensors, how many this and that. Amazing. But anyway... We'll discuss it later on in more detail, just to give you a, a, a quick summary of this, what's, what's going on with all the wiring and all these things. So this is part one, hopefully part two, depends on the views. We'll see you, uh, uh, Joe, Electronic Schematics for Auto.